A few weeks ago, Lisa Pisano was near death, in desperate need of a heart and kidney transplant. But because of how sick she was, she was not a candidate for traditional transplant. So her doctors came to her with a novel approach. A mechanical pump for her heart, paired with a new kidney from a genetically modified pig. I said, I said yes because I didn't have any other options. I really didn't. I was at, I was at the end of my rope. So I just took a chance. And, you know, worst case scenario, if it didn't work for me, it might have worked for someone else. And it could have helped the next person or the next person. When we were able to, you know, offer another option other than just palliative care, she was excited. She knew that this was experimental, that we couldn't in any way guarantee that it was going to be successful, but she wanted to try it. It's like being in a maze and you can't find a way out. And we found a way through that maze, which was to use an organ that we could immediately get from a pig to get her off dialysis and then make, make her a candidate for a uh, heart pump in a timely fashion where she could survive it. This experiment is the latest in a string of attempts to make animal to human organ transplants a reality. Pisano is the second person to receive a pig kidney following a Boston area man's transplant in March who's at home and doing well five weeks post-transplant. I felt desolate before. Like, I just didn't know, I didn't know the ups, the downs, I didn't know, you know, where I was going, where I was headed. So this gives me, this gave me an opportunity and a second chance. So, and I took it. It's been transformative. I mean, she's a different person. She was so ill that when she came in, she had a couple of cardiac arrests. You know, that's how close to death she was. If you feel good, you can kind of start shifting your hip side to side and see if you can, yep, do a little dance. <laughs> 10 days after her kidney transplant, Pisano stood with a group of physical therapists and took her first steps. Good. Nice. nice. Good, and back, just because where uh, the lines are. Keep coming, keep coming, keep coming. I want to spend time with my grandkids. Do stuff with them. Run around with a dog. <laughs> Can't just sit here and do nothing. Right.